Well, tonight at 10, a CDC investigation into a listeria outbreak of Dole packaged salads revealed that two people died and 17 became ill. And some of those salads were processed at Dole's Bessemer City facility. Of course, that's right here, close to where we are here in Charlotte. And Queen City News reporter Sydney Heiberger tonight joins us to walk us through everything that we need to know about this outbreak because, you know, these salads are very popular. A lot of people could have these salads at home, but there's a, a date that needs to be a uh, big of concern, right? Yeah, that's absolutely right, Alicia and Brian. There are a few things that the CDC, the FDA, want everyone to know. Now, this initial recall happened back in December. Mm -hmm. The CDC says it affect, affected 13 states. The salads all have an expiration date of just November 30th to January 9th, and they have a lot code that begins with a B. N W or Y. You can find that lot code in the upper right hand corner. This recall includes any of Dole's brands. Those include brands like Nature's Promise, A Hold, H E B, and Simply Nature. Yeah, and Sydney, like Alicia was saying, a lot of people have these salads. Two people unfortunately died. More than a dozen, 17 people got sick. What else do we know about them? Yeah, like I said, those people spanned all 13 states, mostly older age, between ages 50 and 94. These salads were produced at Dole's Bessemer City plant in North Carolina and another plant in Arizona. Those who have gotten sick, like I said, in the older range from 50 to 94, most of them are women. More than 80% are women, and those two deaths did come from Michigan and Wisconsin. By this point, the expiration dates of all those contaminated products has already passed. But if you do have a packaged salad that falls within these guidelines, the best thing you can do is either throw them away or return them to the store you bought them. The CDC also actually recommends cleaning out your refrigerator mm -hmm. and the items in it because you might be surprised Listeria can actually survive in the refrigerator and travel and stay on surfaces or contaminate other food in the fridge. Wow, real good information there. And the other thing, too, is when we talk about those dates, a lot of people might say, well, those dates seem so far, in like December and early January, but you never know. If you don't clean out your refrigerator, those salads, and you don't want somebody to be able to eat that salad, but good information there. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Thank you, Sydney. Well, if you need any more information about this recall, we encourage you to check out your uh, our website at qcnews.com, where you can find out all the information that you need to be able to know. Sydney, thank you.